So I'm going to come in again with like my soft knee, my little uh, pigeon foot, right? Ooh. Can you move no, you're fine. I'm just trying to get over it. I'm trying to hook into her. So what I want to do is I want to get here below the bone and above the breast tissue. Sorry, I'm sawing at you. I want to try to get over. I'll just sink in. Is that enough? I know. Oh, I'm just so freaking that? short. Can you come in just a slightly bit? I don't want you to come all the way over. Perfect. Mm -hmm. This is my, my problem with table. Mm. All right. There we are, Peck. I'm in a weird position now when I bring my bottom foot up. Right? So I'm sinking into her body, shearing down towards her feet. Take a deep breath in. I don't have to do a lot of breath, so I wouldn't actually bring my knee until she's breathing out, typically. Deep breath in. Come out slowly. Deep breath in. I'm going to do another point here. And breathe out. Oh, I feel that on doubts. Damn, I cannot. No, you're just too no. fucking short. You're good. No, you were where a pack attachment was, too. Say if I was on the mat. I know. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> if I just had legs. Right? Yeah. See, I'll see how I, I literally could not reach this table. But what I'm trying to do, if I have longer legs, I'd be hooking in. I can kind of do it. I, just, I think I just feel more, mm -hmm. like, I know I can get into it better when I'm more above. Oh, yeah. But, but this, I, this is good. This feels amazing. Like, she's, she's being a perfectionist, quite honestly, because this feels amazing as a receiver in the next six months. Thank you. Because I definitely feel it in my pecs. Take a deep, full breath in. And out. When I have a client that has super tight pecs, we'll go through a couple of those full breaths. Pretty much everyone has scaling issues, right? Everyone's shortened, we're all working in front of us, we're pulling in. So with those big deep breaths, right, the scaling's coming to attach to that first and second rib. I'm doing scaling work right now, right? Doing some pec work, opening those scalings a little bit for her. Some clients do keep their head turned the other way, right? And so it's even more of a stretch. You know, I could even come in and... Oh, yeah, this is amazing. Uh, I'm barely, my hand's just holding her in place. Yeah. But it's taking the pressure off of me having to do it. Oh, that makes sense. And I'm going to slowly come out. Ooh, that feels so good. You need a delt? Mm hmm Enough pressure? Mm-hmm. Oh. So good. I feel like my dog and then my bicep. Oh, now I want it. Better there? Yes. Oh, you wanted it there. Okay. So my she's filling her bicep because my leg is a little obviously going across there. Oh, it's awesome and amazing. And she I likes it. it. Get it on. Release. Maybe I noticed when I was sitting there mobilizing her arm in the beginning, maybe I noticed there's a little adhesions in here. I'm going to give her a little, a little more of the anterior delt. This feels awesome, y'all. Right? I'm serious. I'm just giving him a little love. And this is where it kind of sucks I have to pull her to me because now I need to push her away a little bit. Because I'm going to bring the same pigeon, right? I'm going to bring this leg. I'm going to bring it more towards the elbow, though. Is that enough pressure? 
So she already knows what's going on, right? So she's moving her hand. 